Okay, so let's try going back to explore that upper route. See if there might be more treasure to acquire. Oh, that was a <laughs> me interacting with the robot and not the uh, starmen. Okay, at least they didn't do any damage. And didn't work on two out of three enemies. Oh, don't attack that. I uh, do want to try using Jeff's shield killer to see if that will work on these types of enemies. But can. Paul is going to get hurt. Oh, I didn't turn around quick enough. <laughs> I see this fight being... Like, if you lose more than one party member, how would you even win the damage race on these? <laughs> Keeps healing before I can get the killing blow in. Or dodging. There we go. Sneak by this guy. Try to divide my damage here a little bit since there's no healing robot. Turn to steal on my psychic points. enemy didn't even join battle. I almost got back attacked there because I turned away too early.
Psi Flash Omega. I think that hits everybody. And might cause... High probability of insta-killing. Okay, those enemies were not moving at all. If we can take out the Starman Super first. I thought I was already touching them, but apparently not. <laughs> it's hard to know which direction they're looking. something good up here. A broken harmonica. So if I give that to Jeff, there should be a chance that he'll be able to repair it overnight and his inventory is full. So I'm going to give his defense spray to Pooh, who's got lots of room. I'm pretty sure that's everything else broken. Yeah, Jeff should be able to fix it. Meanwhile, everybody's still getting level ups. spell so most of her psychic point usage has been due to enemy stealing just didn't want to get a uh, back attacked by that enemy turning the tables thinking there must be some secret attack from these enemies that they haven't used yet because they're just not as fearsome as the uh, mooks okay that's gonna cut down my attack power So if they were shielding and that other robot was restoring their HP, that would be really bad. Psy Thunder Omega? And this is one where it's hard to know who it's going to target. 200 points of damage four times, but may is. Mamus can destroy a shield. 
I'm checking that because sometimes the enemies use the same spell, so it's good to know what I'm up against. Alright, glad I got the first hit in here. So far, so good. Oh no. <laughs> Ness is getting homesick, so that's bad. Homesickness can only be cured by talking with mom. I have nowhere near a telephone. And in the meantime, it's gonna do weird stuff. Not listen to commands. At least if I keep getting uh, first attacks, that'll mitigate it a little bit. <laughs> Losing all motivation in battle. Okay, at least he got an attack in there. Some good level ups. Sci Fire Omega. Let's see if that has any special abilities tied to it. Just heavy damage. Just lost a turn thinking about his mom. So my only hope here is that I'm almost through with the dungeon. Like even if there's a save point in here, unless it's a phone, I won't be able to cure homesickness. But I have the mouse. The exit mouse. So, oh, this area is going to be a nightmare to navigate. A broken trumpet. <laughs> I'm running out of uh, space in Jeff's inventory to... Uh, 
repair equipment. So I wonder if the instruments are actually going to be usable by Jeff or maybe the other party members can use those. Yeah, there's treasure this way. A pixie's bracelet. Have any special properties? Prevents hypnotize and increases luck. I already forgot which body part that was supposed to equip on. Because it didn't show up for Paula. Must be on the arm. Give the eraser eraser to poo. Can Ness equip the Pixie's bracelet? Keeping Ness from getting hypnotized is better than worrying about Jeff because of the uh, healing that Ness can cast. Okay, this looked like it was the only path. Like a bunch of people stuck in capsules. I have a feeling something's about to go down. Everybody's captured. It's gonna be a boss fight. Starman Deluxe. I think I want a regular shield and not a Psy shield because the other enemies used physical attacks, the other robot enemies. But maybe Pooh can use the shield Omega on everybody. And of course it uses a spell that is lots of damage to everybody. Let's see if we can heal it all. And he's calling in 
people to help out. <laughs> oh man. Uh, let's see here. Nest does not have any couple life noodles. But things are not looking good at the moment. Probably need to take that one out. I think this is a full heal. If I do that on Paula, then Paula can set up a Psy Shield. Oh, we got robots galore. What if I use the bag of Dragonite? Oh, I can use a defense spray. Help Paul out there. They will whittle away all my psychic points. So might as well use spells when I can. I don't dare use any kind of defensive spell, I don't think. Maybe I should focus on the main one, because it can just keep on calling for help. I don't know about using uh, Okay, so that was a pretty good move. Hurt a bunch of them. That's a one-time use. Is this going to help me at all? Yes. Alright. That was looking kind of grim, but the psychic shield was the way to go. the ability to bring Jeff back. I use some psychic point restoring. Mm -hmm. Oops. All right. Party back in business. Actually, can I examine this? Nope. <laughs> he needed to be saved if he just courageously sat here and waited long enough. Oh, Paul got a ribbon. Only Paula can equip it. Uh, better defense. This is Apple Kid, right? Gonna give me the book? Oh, it's back at the library.
Okay. I'm guessing this means all the enemies have disappeared. Might as well use the mouse. Exit mouse. And directly into an enemy fight, but these guys are no problem. I wonder if they are kind of itching for a fight. Let's get a restore. I don't know if this counts as rusting for Jeff repairing equipment. Can I sell stuff? I can only buy. Okay, time to cure homesickness. Unless beating that boss just automatically fixed it as well. So the souvenir coin... I could give to Jeff or Ness. Maybe I should give it to Jeff. Pretty sure that's better than what he has. Oh yeah, way better. Time to teleport back to want it. shop which is also on the way to the library sell some old stuff oh I don't want to buy so one diamond band Sell the old lucky coin. Okay, I think that's it as far as stuff to sell. I can swap a couple life noodles back onto Jeff. Ness need one? Probably. Time to visit the library. That's not the library. But it was up here somewhere. on the other side, over to the east.
We just sneak behind the buildings here. Okay, found Overcoming Shyness. That's exactly what it says. I think I should try staying at the end here, just because it'll be cheap. And Jeff might be able to repair some of the broken equipment. Still 140 bucks. Fix the broken cannon. not the instruments. <laughs> I'm making the headline news. Uh, oops, is this going to be better than the death ray? It's a little bit worse. Do I have any special ability? Nope. Should I maybe just sell it off right away? This local drugstore buy a devastating weapon. Deposit some of this cash. Got tons of money. Whoops. I wanted to put it a value in. Couple party members look like they're pretty close to leveling up again. And I need to warp back to. Deep Darkness? Tenda Village. <laughs> Maybe I will use. Who's teleport? Since that requires less room, and I am going to get a free heal anyway. Harmonica became the baddest beam. So he didn't equip, he didn't fix the, uh, 
other thing at the same time for some reason. Maybe it's just a chance that he can fix things. Maybe because I moved to a different area. Let's try resting again just to see. Oh, can't re-rest. I can't use the shyness book. I can't give it to him because he's not a party member. Can I use the shyness book on you? <laughs> Pretty sure I need to use this somehow. Don't want to drop it. Maybe going to the other one I can talk to over here. Let's we'll fix everybody's shyness. There we go. I get some tended kraut in return. Time for a photo opportunity. Fuzzy pickles. Uh oh, I'm getting called out. This is the correct name. Yes, I'm absolutely certain. <laughs> okay, just a random option to change your name in the middle of the game. Oh, sweet. Another bag of Dragonite. Let's give that to Pooh, who made good use of it last time. Some serious slowdown with all the heavy sprite action going on here. See if we can get some more equipment repaired. Yes, I would like some tea. What is in this tea?
Okay. <laughs> uh. A little intermission there. Horn of Life. Hall of Fame Bat. If I had a Horn of Life, I would give it. I don't even know if I've seen that for sale. Big scary dinosaurs. And a talking stone. Okay. Leans onward to the dungeon. Probably save before I venture down in there. Let's see how deadly these dinosaurs are. Oh, I also wanted to see what does Tendekraut do? Um, it must be a special item. It's not talking about any kind of restore. Okay, got to talk to a rock somewhere down here. Looks like it's going to be a challenge to navigate. Got holes, some with ladders. Are these the same old foopies from before? Nope, they are way more experienced. Luck capsule. Might as well use this right away. Let's make Ness extra lucky. Not sure if these little enemies are supposed to be dinosaurs or not, and there's like a million of them on the screen. Bobby. Vulnerable to fire, freeze, paralysis, brain shock. I think these might be j here just to help me heal. Why are there so many? Since they're vulnerable to fire. They can cause some nasty effects. Tons of experience or not much danger. Side caramels. 
There's another batch of them. Okay, Pooh also has Psy Magnet Omega. Considering how easy these are, they're giving me quite a bit more experience than all those nasty robots I fought in the previous dungeon. Can't quite one-shot him though. Yeah, one of these. Uh, I'm going to try to find my way back to the entrance. Okay. Try going in order. And then probably going to fight something much stronger downstairs. the looks of this. Uncontrollable sphere. Vulnerable to fire. Can be hypnotized. Oh, it's gonna roast us though. And it explodes, that's not great. <laughs> that enemy was way worse than anything upstairs. what this other thing is. Conducting spirit? Okay, at least it didn't use sci-fi on us. Oh, this is going to be awful. Getting confused and all sorts of bad status ailments. Uh, probably shouldn't attack with Ness because there's a good chance it's going to land on one of my party members. Thank <laughs> you. 
also don't think I should try healing. Although, maybe I can deflash my party members. Can't use Alpha. I have trouble remembering which healing does what. Okay, Beta stops crying. Scary. Thankfully, I put the sphere to sleep early. Okay, Ness can now restore party members from. Oh, I need beta. Oh, I need omega, gamma. Pick one of these letters. Gamma, okay. So I can see this place being a huge magic drain. A super bomb. I think only Jeff can use those. Nope. Time to fight a sworn of hobbies. should be healing with Pooh because Pooh can use the side magnet omega. What happens if I fall down this pit? Oh, that just leads to the same area. The same awful fight. Nice job, Paula. So I don't have a any kind of party heal the party life up do i just ness so yeah jeff i mean ness can do the healing but who can do the resuscitation i always get the life up and the healing swapped Starting to be able to one shot. So 
So over here, there was a normal ladder down. Prep for battle here. Paul is just murdering these enemies. So we're way up. IQ capsule. Let's have Polly use it. Another group of hobbies, foopies. Hobby. Okay, level ups there. Diadem of Kings. I have a feeling this is something for Pooh. Yes. Nice little defense boost. I don't think that offense meter is very accurate because he can hit harder than that number, I'm pretty sure. See if Paula can one shot this enemy. There's two more ways down. was just one way down. These jerks. Get 
putting this to sleep is incredibly useful. Thankfully the spell... doesn't seem to be affected by the status ailment. Oh no. Okay, at least the spirit's out of the way. I think I do need to use up some more psychic points here to restore our hit rate, or not. Time for a phone call. Okay, this is not the one that I needed to talk to. I think they must have overestimated the number of dinosaurs down here. Maybe it's just the... Uh, Final boss might be. Oh no. Okay, it's enjoying the battle, that's great. one spawned behind me. Hyper spinning robo. I want to make sure that one dies. If you can get some more psychic points back. Okay, it doesn't explode at least. This combo again. Deflected one shot. This might be bad for Paula, but I think I need to stay on the offense. Come on, let me out of battle. Okay.
Okay, at least I don't have to fight three of those enemies. Keep focusing on... The conducting spirit, because that status element is awful. I can assume this robot does not have psychic points. Rock candy. I think that restores psychic points. The downside of hypnotizing the sphere. Of course, the only one it didn't negatively affect is Pooh. Paula can try attacking still. Nice job, Paula. Of course, use the healing spell on the enemy. Can Jeff use the HP sucker? You gonna hit the party? Okay, so that restored even though he felt unusual. If I can sneak a little side points away. Actually, Paula can attack. It's just Jeff that I have to be careful with. Okay, I'm good for now. Oh, that is not a back attack. At least it only laughed at me. Not strong enough to take it out with those three, though. Oh, this is real bad. because of that back attack. Threw me for a loop. Maybe I should actually eat some of this food I never use. Uh, 
Uh, let's look over here first. Yes, treasure. Deluxe water. I remember there was a ladder up over there. There's a ladder up over here. Check the other one first. Couldn't get the attack off in time. Oh, that is fatal. more scarier than I realized. That's going to chew through my psychic points. by these enemies, but I'm only fighting one at the moment. me yet. Actually, it would be better if I wasn't getting the auto-defeat, I think. They seem to be indifferent to my existence. At least I'm getting some free stats. Here we go. theory, if I was really in trouble, I could just hop up and down that ladder, get these to regenerate, and just keep stealing all their uh, psychic points. Couple of noodles. Got room for three more items. Oh, thank you. This is the Earth's belly button. Luxury jerky. Nope, don't use it. <laughs> 300 HP recovery, okay. Let Jeff hang on to that for a bit because he might be able to make use of that. Okay, now we're fighting a crowd. Thank <laughs> you. 
At 13 points off of that. Can I get another? Whose psychic points looking better now? I'm gonna get even more from the level up. All right, that's a boss. A rabbit's foot. But isn't that going to interfere with? Yeah, Pooh's defense. Gonna go way down. It's body armor? Let's just see if it's anything that all we can make use of. One point better than a crystal charm. That protects from paralysis, so maybe hang on to it for now. HP or psychic points. Already forgotten which of these ladders I just went up. Must be the left one. Would the right one go down to that same area? Uh, I'm just going to assume that was the same path. Because it kind of feels like this is the same one. I will check the other one just in case. Was that the route that went back around? Is this the one where I came up from. Yeah, I think that path was from the other side. I think the only thing left here is the boss fight. Let's do a little bit of healing with who, who's got psychic points to spare now. some more. Watch these destroy me.
hoping there's not like a souped up version of these that suddenly become powerful enough to destroy me with their spells. Okay, Pooh's maxed out. the rabbit's foot could that be something that Jeff could equip I'd be giving up the flame pendant which has been very good I think I'm going to hang on to that. Yeah, Paula can restore. I don't think she's... I've been using much in the way of spells with her. Yeah, she doesn't have any... Nothing restored. Some kind of a boss fight. Electro Spectre. I'm gonna guess this thing will use. Electricity attacks, so maybe a Psy Shield is in order. It does use electric, but it's not technically a spell. Got huge defense. And I whittle away its defense. Didn't work. Okay, that tool did not work. of not sure if I should use a spell. Although I have the shield, I could try a weak freeze just to see what happens. Okay, she's got a shield, or it's got a shield, so maybe I can try neutralizing it. I can't defense down. I can certainly offense up. Keep boosting the mess. Can I destroy the shield? Did not work. Probably should try that again just to make sure. But who's in trouble? Oh, 
Okay, I can get double deflected. Its shield has disappeared. Wait, I'm confused as to whose shield... <laughs> Who still has a shield here? Maybe I should put up another size shield. Trying to steal our HP. Going to do a tentative freeze here. Okay, it is vulnerable. Now, Polly can go wild with a Freeze Omega. This is going to work out great. Paul is going to be churning through the psychic points. Nice job. Glad I'm still hanging on to that Franklin badge. Just in case there's something bad along the way. Kind of a glowing cave. Alright, that was bizarre. Lumine Hall. Uh, what's going on here? Extra tiny. See what looks like treasure way up there. Is this a cave? Oh, this is dinosaur land.
There's a geyser up there. Is that something I need to be checking out? Okay, this doesn't... <laughs> what the heck is that? I don't think I want to encounter that dinosaur. You can use the trees to block its path. It looks happy, but I don't think that's a good sign. And I'm stuck. Not sure if this rock thing was an enemy or not. It has disappeared. Case of danger, evacuate here. These look like more of those tenda. Blue screens for health, red springs for healing. Oh, here we go. This looks like a telephone bird. 